Hello, welcome to episode 6 of Stoke Radio's Retro Lounge. We're going to have an amazing time tonight as we're looking at top-down maze games. Kind of based on Pac-Man-ish. Uh, picked by the wheel last week. So uh, I've got a, a handful of lesser-known top-down maze games. And then if we've got some time later, we'll just have a random... Look around and see what we fancy, shall we? Okay. So, there's not really any order to these. I've not got them ordered by system. I'll try and order them by system in the show notes for you. But let's uh, let's have a look and see which one we fancy first, shall we? Oh yes, all the stuff from last week. If you didn't join us last week, movie tie-ins. P part one, I guess, because there's an awful lot of movie tie-ins. Um, I tell you what, I know that this one is uh, an Atari VCS one, so let's start there, shall we? It's as good a place as any. Um, there we go. I wish there was a way of fixing that. But uh, Okay, we're going to be playing a game called Mousetrap. Now, while I was researching this, um, maze games, basically, it seemed that, surprisingly, strangely, I don't, I don't know why, but it seems like that in the early 80s, there was a lot of maze games, and then all of a sudden, there was none non-maze games um, so the Atari VCS ColecoVision Master System and NES era, era were mostly maze games uh, no sorry most of the maze games were from then um, but yeah then they died off so uh, let's have a little play of Mousetrap um, okay Oh yay, pad's not working. Again. Please bear with me one second while well, we have technical difficulties. We have these difficulties because I've been arsing around with my controllers all uh, all week as I have uh, my new six-button controllers arrived, but I'm using that on my mister at the moment. But, uh, yeah, I was fannying on with them, so, um, so that's weird. He's brought up the controller for a Virtual Boy. It's not a Virtual Boy. Here we go. Right, is that going to work? Yep. Okay, so you're a mouse. Whoa. And uh, there's cats coming to get you. But if you have one of them, unlike Pac-Man, where they immediately become blue, um, you save it and you, on your uh, action button, you can turn into a dog. There you go. Which is useful because these dog bits are in um, dead ends for all intents and purposes. So. Whoa, crap. Sure about these ones in the middle. How do you get to them? Hmm, okay. Oh, 
Right, I don't know how I did that. Okay, and like every good maze game, you start again. Whoa! And for those long time watch, I say long time, we're only on episode 6, but these long time watchers, um, you know that I quite often have problems with down on my joypad. And I don't know why that is. I do feel like I have to let go of the pad. Oh, fuck. Oh, dead. Dead. How disappointing. Uh, okay, let's let's have another crack at that, shall we? Oh, how do you restart? Oh. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. So this is an Atari game, and the Atari joystick only has one button, and yet, in order for me to change that maze round. Like that. I have to press two buttons. Okay. Still, I don't know how to restart it. Nope. Might have to do a reset. Oh, that cat just jumped out at me for no reason. Other than it being a cat, obviously. And I'm messing around. I've obviously done something to change the colour scheme. I feel we're going to be seeing a lot of... Whoa! running around mazes, picking up power pills and shit. So, it does making the maze look good? It doesn't make any dead ends, does it? Oh, shit. There might be some strategic reason to move. Um, the what's it about? Oh, does it like the cats out straight away? Maybe, maybe you can trap a cat. I know, I'm dead. Well, let's go. Then we'll move on to other mazy things. Oh, I tried to be too clever then. Feels like you can only do the maze flipping when you don't have a dog. Oh no. Stand corrected. We're all learning together. Well, oh, I just ran into the back of it then. Time as any to kick this into touch. Let's minimize that. There you go. That was Mousetrap on the Atari VCS. So, what other Atari VCS ones do we have? Well, let's see if we can do them all at the same time. Ah, I think Bank Heist. Um, maybe. Maybe. Let's see. And if I'm not mistaken, I think 
bank heist. Oh no, I'm thinking of something else, don't worry. See, you know, that's massive this time, this screen. So let's bring it in so you can see it. There we go. Uh, another top-down maze with you running around and things chasing you. Which is the name of the game tonight. That's what it's all about. Running around mazes. Um, okay, let's see. There you go. So you get the um, silver things, banks, and then you have to get out before the police get you oh not that one then let's try this one yeah there you go so whoa 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 oh. dag nab it now it must be it's the gas just the way it sets a timer for you I wonder if you didn't get any banks, whether, um, whoa, tits. If you didn't get any banks, whether the police would bother coming after you. Sod it. Do it run it. Never take me alive, copper. Oh, I wish I'd stopped going backwards and forwards. I bet you never did that on an Atari joystick. I bet it just wasn't possible. Sod it. No! Trap myself! Is that a hiding place? It's not a hiding place. I trapped myself. <sighs> Got through that first maze so well. Try again, shall we? See, look, I can't... I'm going to try and stop complaining about my joypad. Honestly, I am. I am. Look, backwards and forwards is that... You're not here to listen to me complain about my joypad. You want to... You want to see some... Old maze games, that's what you want. Oh! I'll tell you what I think it is. I think it's that I'm not moving. my finger off the pad so it's kind of it's so sensitive it don't really know the Atari part of it's going what the fuck I don't understand crap So yeah, if you ever see me doing a stupid move like that, you know what it is. Whoa! Only now, at the end, do I understand the power of a bomb that I can just drop. Wish I'd worked that out sooner. I'm dead. Is that it? Oh no, one more. Oh, I'm running out of time and I don't know how to get any more petrol, if indeed you can get any more petrol.
No. Dag nabbit. Should we have one more go? See how we get on. Right, so I can drop bombs, but I don't know how to get petrol, if indeed I can. Okay. Come here. Oh, for God's sake. Well, I didn't want to do that. I know, I know, I could have got it. But that's like just being greedy. I did just pause there just to check to see if uh, they would chase me even if I didn't do anything. Oh, I thought I got that down quick enough. Apparently not. Get out of this maze. Oh, not that way. Shit. God, in some ways it's a little bit like Dragon's Lair. I have to do the the down on my pad like just a second or two before um oh, I can blow myself up with it. A second or two before I actually want to move there. No, that's it. Running out of petrol. <sighs> Shame it doesn't give me more petrol. That's not very fair. Oh, disappointing. Okay, there you go, that was Bank Heist. Uh, on the Atari VCS or the 2600, depending on where you're from. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so... Where do we want to go next? Let's have a look. I think... Oh, let's do... Let's do Oil's Well. Kind of a, an outlier on this one. It's it's a weird one, this one. Um, in that there is a maze, so I felt it fit in. Oh, this might actually be. We might be moving on to. Um, we might be moving on to Clecker Vision Games. So, let's have a look at Oils Well, shall we? Oh, come on, yeah. Okay, so, like I say, this is different than the others that we've got because you play, <coughs> excuse me, you play a driller. Drilling. Um, oh, what have we got here? I would assume regular is easy. Double edit is normal. Let's try this. So you have to get the stuff in the maze, but you're that little purple thing and you can't be eaten by stuff. So you've got to, and it's really difficult, once you go past the junction like here, if I go past that I won't be able to go down, I can't come back. 
I have to use my fire button to come back to, well, however long you... Look, you see that then? So, you have to time... Look, you see, I have to go back now because this one's coming along the top. But now I can start... Oh, now I can start again. Now, this is where my annoying D-pad gets... Oh, for fuck's sake. And you have to get... Whoa, quick. Ah, you see, it touched me at the top. So then you have to start again, you have to... Oh, you see, I didn't mean to go up then either. Right. Nope. See, I can't press my button. Okay, can't eat them either. Oh, you're dead. Um, the idea, I think the, the main art, you can eat all the power pills, but you can eat all the things in the maze, and then um, but you have to get the thing at the bottom. That's that's what you have to do. Um, I'm just wondering if I might have to investigate getting a better stick. For, I wonder if the oh, I wonder if the new Atari VCS stick would pair with my Mac, and we could play it with an Atari VCS kind of controller. Well, it's still digital. Let's have a go again. Oil's well, except it's not. <laughs> Stupid game. Not even had a drink of my iron brew yet. There was a way of controlling how much you retracted. That would be great. Okay, I apologise. This is... Uh... Gonna hurt me? Nope. Super ball points. Whoa! See, that's irritating. Got all the way down there, and I have to come all the way back again. Oh! Oh, why did I press that button then? Dickhead. <sighs> Come back and get these bastards. Nope. Oh, give me a break. Come on, let me just get... Oh. I was going to say, let me just get at least one. Because you notice the, the clock at the top as well that's counting down. Oh, for God's sake. I can't avoid that either. Oh, 
Come on! Now that I've got the main No, I need to go this way. Yo. Okay. Come on. No. No. Ah. Ooh. The one time that I was happy for a Quick retraction. Come on, come on, quick, quick, quick. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to run out of time. There we go. There we go. Oil's well. Um, that irritating background hum. Just, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. You don't, you don't come here to watch me. How good I play. You just come to see the games. Right. Let's move on, shall we? Let's move on to something, something more Pac-Man-y, I would say. Um, here's ColecoVision's Ladybug. Now you can see it. I'm sorry, watcher. You'd have heard it all nice as well. Booby dooby dooby doo. Okay, so we'll press number one on the ColecoVision keypad or oh, keyboard. And off we go with Ladybug. Very much uh, Pac-Man clone. Let's tidy up around the um, hatching area. And then we'll uh, tell you what's going on. Okay, so we get the hearts. The hearts are good because um, they increase your score. If you get them when they're blue, they increase your score. As you can see over on the right. We've got moving gates to cunningly protect ourselves from, um, well, from creatures. Balls, I wanted that as red, not to worry. Let's go across here and get that blue heart. And that needs to be yellow. There we go. So we're building the word extra on the right hand side and the word special on the right hand side. Let's go back to. Oh, I missed it. Didn't get there quick enough. And I open that door right in my face. Tell you what, let's come back to that eye. Oh, I missed it that time. Do you know what? I should just wait, shouldn't I? Let's close, close that door. Unfortunately, there we go. And I could wait and get the pickle, oh, cucumber, uh, but I'm not gonna go into the eggplant oh yes okay same again got to eat all the pills oh so there's a tea there I noticed that's gonna to need to be yellow like that I'm gonna have to wait for that L to come round and be red again so let's get munching some of the uh, 
I don't know. See it? Go, get those hearts. Blue, blue. Time five, score. Didn't get away fast enough. Woo. Oh, dickhead. There you go, the skulls. Bad. In fact, that's a general rule in life. Skulls, bad. Not good for you at all. Oh, bloody jolly pad. Sticking me sticky. Oh, missed it again. Is it worth waiting, or are they going to come round and get me? Oh! Oh! J Dag nab it! Am I going to survive long enough to special? Who knows? I mean, the odds are... No. I'm going to survive long enough to beat my last score. Why is he just looking sideways all of a sudden? Just fucking eat the things. Phew. Oh, bugger. Gonna do a buffalo girl. Yep, go around the outside. Oh, stupid, stupid, stupid. Well, I beat my last score. Which you didn't see because we edited it out of the YouTube video. Um, so yes, we did we did play two of these, but you only saw one of them. But that was Ladybug on the Collector Vision. So let me just check. Let's see. That's Turbo Graphics. That's the NES. Oh, okay. So we're gonna. Oh, actually, Toot and Karma might be. Um... Might be Collector Vision as well. But let's go with one that I know is Collector Vision, and that's Pepper Two. Now, a lot of the things we've been playing tonight have been Pac-Man ripoffs, inspired by Pac-Man. Uh, whereas this Pepper Two. Um, was inspired by Amida. But it's still a maze. You still run around a maze. It's just with Pepper 2, you're zipping up pieces of fabric. I don't know. We'll discuss it as we as we get into it. Let's see. Let's check out Pepper 2. Okay, so... Let's just wait for it to load. Let me make sure it's on screen this time, yes. Okay, press number one. So, you're the little bloke, and you walk around. Oh, uh, and if you walk back over a track that you've been walking over, it unzips it. And that's your Pac-Man power pill bit. You can eat them if you want. And all you have to do is fill up all the spaces. Whoa! So there are a lot of different mazes. So we're on maze one at the moment. But you do have the option to jip out onto other ones if you wanted.
Um, so yeah, like I say, this is very much like Amida. Um, should we go to Maze 2? Oh, I tell you what, Maze 3 is nearer. Let's do Maze 3. So, uh, yeah, only with Amida, I think you're a gorilla with a paint roller. Or you're a paint roller. And you get chased by pigs. Um, which, you know, I can't tell you what these things are. I mean, he's got a little, he's got a little halo. Oh, back to Maze 1, I don't want to go there. So I don't know why he has a halo. Yeah, yep. Uh, sounds to me like you run out of time as well. Or, or you die if you stand too close to them. Uh, that's quite irritating when you've got two pieces that you need to go, but you have to go the long way around to do them. Oh, quick look at Maze 2. Go back to base three. Oh, that's irritating. Okay, how am I going to get that? Not by dying. Okay. Okay, so we've done maze one and three. Shall we go to maze two? See what I mean about you could end up going over places twice. And I'm sure there's a, a nice, intelligent mathematical way of doing it. Is it me or do they feel like they got faster? Where's where's there a, is there a time somewhere? I can't see it. Feel very dangerous following these around like this. It's like you just know it's going to end badly. They do start moving faster. All righty. All right, that's all the maze is done. Yes. There you go, super bonus. And then we rinse and repeat.
Go on, you... Is it going to change before I hit it? Nope. Oh! I see. It can take too long. The maze starts disappearing. Crap. Crap. Yeah, I've gone off chasing them now. I just need to... Fill me box. Uh, what maze was that? Maze four. Should we go to maze one? Light bulb. Whoa, maze two. There you go, maze two. Let's go back. Well... That could be irritating. Not as irritating as that, though. See what I like about this game? It's you get plenty of lives. And you've seen how I play. You know, I need them. Feel you get so many lives with this that it's um, possible we'll only play one game with this um, because we do have a few to get to and I'm conscious time is ticking on oh, where the freaking hell am I going come on Mr Pepper 2 it's not a bloody running around. Okay, there's one up there. Didn't you? Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! Ref. You bastard. Okay, that was Pepper 2. Not Pepper Pig. Pepper 2. Uh, like I say, very much like Amandar, but I'm sure you agree, still Pac-Man-y looking, just a different um, end goal. Right, where are we going to go next? Um, tell you what, I think Toot and Carmoon is... A collector vision one, so let's stick with collector vision. And this is again slightly different. You're not running, you're in a maze, and it's a top down maze, and that covers what we're doing tonight. Number one. Oh no, not on that screen, you want. You have to actually be on the game screen, don't you? Here we go. Well, okay. All right, so one button points. One point, one button shoots one way, and one shoots the other. So you get your key, and you go that way. Oh, crap. Because again, I can't go. Oh, I can't move right and left. <coughs> now we're rotating. I'm glad you die like you start at the same place when you died. Oh, that's good. 
I just wish I could trust my my joypad and I can't. Right. Let's get a key. Open that. Whoa. Oh, shit. Uh, if I can play this with the uh, <laughs> the bloody analog sticks and again oh I don't really know how to uh... so let's just reset that was only on one <sighs> Try again. Getting back out of here, that's the uh, the issue. Come on. Hey look, I only lost a handful of lives to get through that stage. Wow, look at me. Nope. quite fast those little crow like jobbies oh i must supposed to get through that say it. it's quite an Egyptian vibe but yeah of course it is it's a bloody it's called Tutankhamun fuck off
go. Okay. There you go. Tutan... Oh, I keep calling it Tutankhamun, but it's Tutankham. Tutankham from 1983. Uh, on the Clecker Vision. Um, a maze game. Indeed. Okay, let me... Uh, let me change this one so I don't forget. Let, oh, it's better that I change you guys first. And then I know. Uh, so, what are we going to look at next? I think we should probably... Have a look at the Turbo Graphics system. Um, which I've never... I've, I've got... Um, I've got... A Turbo Graphics and a Turbo Graphics Portable... I don't think I've ever played this game though, so let's see if I recognise it. It's called Crater Maze. And in all honesty, I can't even tell you if it follows the um, the top-down maziness that we've been doing so far. So let's find out, shall we? Crater Maze. Push run button. One would assume that's start, would one? Ooh, is there an easy? Is there an easy? There's not. So we're playing it normal. Oh, is this a start button one? Yeah, okay. Oh, what what have we got here now? Are you getting all the screen on? Let's take a trip through time aboard a magic carpet ship. Right. I am Kublai, dedicated follower of the Zen Zombie. Zombie does not like intrudes on his lands. You're in trouble. Okay, we're in trouble. I'm gonna kidnap your friends and put them in prisons of another world. That's not very English. Don't worry, my friends. I'll do my best to save you. Believe in me. What the holy crap are we in for? Am I a teddy bear in a jetpack? That's what it looked like. Okay, so, so far so good. Maisie. Treasure. We've got buttons. What do the buttons do? Let's find out. Okay. Sneeze out black goo. Do we have another button? Nope. Okay, can't get a gist of how big this uh, maze is just yet. Let's go this way. Yes, that's going that way. I assume we have to get all the chests. Do we get the ones up there? Yeah, I think so. Alright. Does it go any further down? It doesn't look like it. So if I get that one... Ah, that answers my question. Oh, what's the NEC? Whoa. Oh, oh no! Definitely a maze. Oh, what's that thing in the middle? What does that do? Do we need to find out? Uh, okay. Does that allow us to jump over that green thing, maybe? I'll just get that one while it's, while it's there. Oh, 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 run away, run away. Oh, joint point again. Oh, 
horizontal maze, this one. I bet it. I imagine I can't fall in the water. Oh! I don't have. I was going to say I don't have any bloody things, but I was using the wrong button. Okay. Don't have any C's worth a lot of money, so. Alright, I quite like this. Never, never seen this one before. It's not one I've got on my Turbo Graphics. That I'm aware of. I might have. It's been a long time since I've had it out. Oh, what are the coloured things? Coloured things good or bad? Um, could be dangerous if you're not paying attention is what I think of them. Oh, all right, crap bags. Not, not uh, only could be dangerous if you're not paying attention, but actually essential to play the game. Um, all right, and we're going to get in there. Do this first. No, nope, this way. One would assume there's another teleport in place from. Uh, maybe it's that corner. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, only fucking shirt balls. So, is it back up here then? what you do. You have to go through it twice. And when you come out of it, you go that way instead. Shit! See? That flying thing just freaked me out and I went, ooh, ooh! Oh no. That's harsh doing that to me, you little shit. Oh, I've fucking done it again because of my bloody pad. Oh, my fat fingers on my pad is perhaps what I should say. It's so easy to do a down when you should be doing an up or a... Oh, what am I going to do now? I'm going to go in there. There, in there, out there. Have I got everything? Oh, but now I've got to go back. Yeah, some shite arc. Uh, I'm going back this way so I don't have to do a portal again. Okay, so if you, if you just joined us, we're playing Create a Maze at the moment. We're looking at maze games on this episode. And uh, Create a Maze is on the Turbo Graphics system. I, don't think, I think this is our first Turbo Graphics game that we've played. Ah, where we're going to start now. I mean, it's mostly big in Japan. I don't think it had a... I know collectors like it, but it's, um, it's not very well known here in Britain. Oh, didn't expect to come out there. Okay, I see. So, I 
Ah. Okay. So, what's it giving me a shovel for? Is it just giving me a shovel for... Prizes? Like, cherries in the middle of um, the Pac-Man maze? Or... Can I do something with it? <laughs> Dag, I bet I needed to be in there, didn't I? Nice. But I need to go back there now to get the other chests. Is it going to send me in the same place? It is. Okay. Do, 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 do. So I have to actually go into this one. Is that it? Oh, you rebel scum. Right, I forget where the door is now. I think it's long here somewhere. Are you going to go the other way? You're not. Okay. Whoa. I only pressed the button once. Why didn't I get a special bonus? What did I miss? If you watch on YouTube, let us know in the comments. What did I miss? Have you played this before? Crater Maze? I keep wanting to say Crater Face. I think I'm getting everything that I should. I got bloody shovels last time. What, what, you know, what's going on? Whoa. anything behind. Maybe it's a time thing. So I'm certainly getting the uh, the NEC. Let's run to the door, see how quick we can do it. Thought I was going to die then. Okay, that was quite quick. Was it not? Why no why no special bonus? Why? What am I missing? See, I wanna know what the diggy things are. Come on. Get me some bomberman power-ups, that's what we're talking. So we need to avoid the dark hole things. So it looks to me like something jumps out and it ch Wow, this maze is big. Don't have any buttons that do anything. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, bastard. You're gonna fly me right on top of that green thing, really. So what's that? It looks like signposts or crosses or something. I don't feel I'm missing anything. Ooh, gun! Gun! I mean, am I supposed to be blasting blocks away or something? No, oh, that was pointless. Why is that? Oh no, does that mean I've lost my gun? So I'm still farting out green, uh, black liquid. And I can't hit them. Hit them when they're down. Right, what have I got a spade for? I mean, obviously, last week we had um, we had one of our chat. Oh, I missed the NEC. Didn't look for the NEC. Oh. We had one of our chat members screaming because I was doing the wrong thing. And I hope that's not the case tonight. Um, Straights to get trapped in, that's not good. That's a new thing, I'm putting down all that oil. That's, uh, I was only doing one before. Let's see, I feel I recognise this sort of building. We're looking down on buildings, aren't we? Feels very squid gamey to me. Thing there. Go on, bugger off. Okay, I'm still gonna have to do two more runs at it. Ugh. Wait, wait. Hmm. Okay. I've got one left somewhere. Come to that thing. There you are. And got the NEC that time. There's something else flashing that I should be collecting. Whoa there. Making me very sad that no special bonus. It's a good job the music's happy. Hey, 
that's what my shit joypad needs. Bloody lots of lefts and rights. Oh, do I have to go into a cave now? What's the torch for? Torch, then take it off me. Can't remember where the door was. Now, oh, come on, that was a super quick time. My shoulders. Do you know, ironically, I think we might have to uh, call it quits because we've got other games to get to, you know? We've been playing this for so long. I wouldn't want to keep you lovely people for uh, a whole two hours if we can avoid it. What's that you say? Oh shit, two hours. If it makes you feel any better, it hasn't been two hours. Just a lot myself two hours. Because I don't know how crap I'm going to be. What am I carrying now? Is it a bomb? Or is it a cool yo-yo? Let's find out on this green thing, shall we? Oh, it is a cool yo-yo. And the bomb! Do you get extra super duper points for killing it? Wow, look how long my oil goes now. No specials. I'm blue instead. Don't actually think OpenMU. Oh, actually, OpenMU might have safe states. Um, in which case, we might just uh, save it. Shemmy's not more of you in the chat room, and you could have said, no, no, carry on, or please stop. nothing I'm like I just thought I am gonna come out next Those, those spears, they're not metal tongues, are they? Oh, just teleported away from them. Oh, dickhead. Right, let's go the long way. Pick the key up. Get the neck. Right, where did we see the door? Yeah. 
Did we see the doll? Yes, we did. There it is. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to create a safe state. Um, because we have been on here quite a long time. Uh, what's it? It's create a maze. Um, you can't see it, I don't think. Or, or maybe you can. No, you can't. You can't see it. But, uh, yeah, we're going to create a save. And then, you know, one day, maybe you won't even see, but I'm going to come back and play some more of that. Um, save game. There we go. So, we'll pause that and we'll move on to our next... Um, where are we? We should do Master System before we do um, Mega Drive, shouldn't we? Um, yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. So, we'll go to OpenMU. So that's what I use. Uh, at the moment, that's what I'm using to show you these games. OpenMU is free and runs on everything. Uh, but I also am using RetroArch as well for arcade machines. Though you won't see any tonight, but I've got um, that's good at arcade emulation. And I finally turned on and started configuring my Mister FPGA, which will um, emulate all sorts. It's just it's quite complicated. Um, so, yeah, I'm just in the process of uh, copying some of my ROMs onto an SD card and seeing how well they work and how I can get, you know, making sure my joypad works and you have to configure the joypad for every single car or machine, as we would call it. Um, but it's quite, quite the device. I'm quite um, looking forward to when it all works. Okay, so on the Master System now, Sega Master System, we have Fantasy Zone The Maze. Clues in the title, it's a maze show, it's a maze game. Um, okay, so when I, was look when I was looking at these, I did, um, I did initially look for everything that has um, Maze in the title. Uh, but some of those games, not mazes. Or, they are mazes, but they're not the sort of maze that... Um... Oh, I need to change my pad, do I? God's sake, come on. It's been working. Well, to a fashion, it's been working. Oh, no, Master System, not Mega Drive. Whoop, whoop. Don't play many Master System games. Never had a Master System. Went straight to a Mega Drive. Okay. Well, let's set up for this. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait, do we hit one? No. Oh, I see. We just pressed the fire button. Oh, that's horrible. Okay, I guess we could have bought something then, but... Um, so, Pac-Man with spaceships, do we think? Oh, what am I hurrying up for? What do I... Was I supposed to get something there? Touch this spot. That's what she said. Oh, I ran into it. That was my fault, that. Stupid. Uh, do, I have, do I not have weapons? Do I not have a shooter for shooting? Alright, shooter. Oh, the proper ch Oh. Alright, 
No, I do just have to avoid them or I'm dead. What do I still... Oh, where am I? Oh, I'm game over in. That's where I am. Right. Let's try that again, shall we? I think my start button is set for pause for some reason. Should we pick a different map? Mockstar. All right, let's try that. Still horrendously coloured. Yeah, let's have one of them, shall we? They are quite intelligent, as in they're quite chasey. Is that a gun? It says thank you. What is it? What's it thanking me for? Can I shoot stuff? Nope. Oh. Not done me any good light, but. Oh. Bag of shit. Wow, it's quite difficult, this. Not as easy as that bloody um, game we've just finished playing. And that thing's a lot faster than me. Well, does anybody have any experience with Fantasy Zone The Maze? Anybody? Uh, does that make me go faster, does it? Is that what it is? Well, I was shooting that and I died. Well, now my random joypad it really works a treat because the cat follow me because I'm going like bloody don't know where I'm going. Why am I touching the spot? I'm touching it, I'm touching it! Well, it's fair to say I'm not very good at this. I'm not buying these things. I did. I, I pressed the button. I don't know. I'm hurrying. Goodness, can I almost complete a maze? No. No, I can't. Try pressing the other button next time. Oh, I'm a big red fire. Does that mean I'm invincible? It does. Nice. Might be, and I might be able to finish two mazes. Oh, I 
No selling. Come on! Yeah, that was a little note saying, Yo, shit! Do I have to get that penguin? I do. Yeah, there's no point in giving me wings and then killing me. You shit bag. Okay, so there you go, that was Fantasy Zone. The maze. Kinda pack, Manny. I'm sure you'll agree. Uh, okay, we're we're down to our last couple now. Don't worry. We're nearly there. Nearly there. Uh and we're gonna go with Dun 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 um Papenga Penguin. Uh, sorry, Papenga Pengo. Is what we're gonna go with next. Um as ostensibly it's a Mega Drive game, but I think it might be a Japanese Mega Drive game. So we find out. Okay. Wrong screen. Let's try again. Oh, have I minimised you? Where are you? There you are. Loud and garish with blue penguins all over. How could I have missed you? Pengo! Okay. Let's play arcade mode because I don't want to be all night. Squash the snow bees. Okay. Ah, look, a maze. Oh, okay. Nope, that's not what I wanted at all. So, you would think if I do that, get in there. Okay. Can I move that one? Oh, I can. Oh, oh, dead. Dead. It's been a long time since I have played Pengo. Oh, right in my face. these guys oh did I oh look at that I inadvertently succeeded <laughs> uh, no bonus so oh, okay F you I'm going to push that one. It started eating it. Bastard. So obviously, I said this is a Mega Drive one. This is this is the arcade um, version of it. There is a cartoonia penguin. Oh. Squirrely rabbit.
I'm obviously getting tired. <laughs> I wonder if there's any way of going back so you can see the other one. Um, oh, I don't know what I've got set up there, but he keeps wanting me to screen capture. No, busy. Busy. Um, do you know what? I think we're done. Yeah, I think we're done. I think there's only one more game that I think we should we should have a look at, shouldn't we? Um If you've watched the other episodes, you know you know that I'm gonna blame my uh, control but we should at very least have a look at pac-man the inspiration for a lot of these games we've played tonight we should at least have a go um okay i don't think there's anybody who hasn't seen... Oh, come on, go down! Who knows the score where Pac-Man is concerned. That's quite an irritating noise. I'd forgotten about that high-pitched uh, whiny noise. Come on! Whoa. You know, when the new circuit board comes for my arcade stick, I'm going to be very happy. I won't have anything to blame, like, but I'll be very happy. Come on, at least let me bloody do one maze. At least have done one maze before we go. Backwards and forwards, then. What in the freaking hell are you doing, Pat Man? These monsters eat you at split second if you don't. Oh <laughs> shit! 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 Oh, I'm dead now. <laughs> oh, crap it now. Hey, two mazes. I mean, we do have on the wheel um, the whole series of Pac-Man games because it isn't just running around a maze eating uh, power pills, you know. Pac-Man was in a, a whole host of games. Um... And one day the wheel is going to pick 
all these to go. Look, that's it. You've, you've all seen Pac-Man. You know what Pac-Man is. I just felt he had to be on the maze episode, don't you think? Um, if we do another maze episode, it won't be top-down mazes. It might be um, first-person perspective. Yes. Uh, right. Okay, so you know what time it is. As Michael McIntyre would say, would say, it's time to spin the wheel. Uh, and of course, I lose the wheel every time I, uh, I t <laughs> turn off the browser. So, let me find it again for you. Here we go. Ah, It does make a clicky-clicky noise. Um, but I just haven't hijacked this tab because I don't want my whole browser uh, ticky-ticking. So, okay. Let's spin the wheel and find out what we're going to do next week on episode 7. Uh, as you've noticed, I've uh, it's been updated. There's more on the wheel. Now, maybe we should cover that before we get started. So, um, if you're new, if you've not seen another episode, we have uh, SGDS. So this is same game, different system. And we're going to play all the different versions to see how it's um, evolved over over the uh, difference and some of these games they're on they're on everything i've tried to pick classic games we've also got ihnp i have never played uh, a couple of big franchises i think you'd say that i've never played a game of um so they're on there where you see a picture so we've got uh, we've got sonic he's a new addition and we've got mario we're gonna do oh frogger he's not been a donkey kong uh, if it lands on one of them, this is what I was talking about, about Pac-Man. You see the Pac-Man ghost there? We're going to do um, all not all the games. We're going to have a, a random assortment of games featuring from that franchise. So that's that one. Genera speaks for itself. Uh, what else have we got? I think that's it. So um, let's, let's spin the wheel, see what happens. Let's see what we're doing next week. What have we got? Oh, Frogger! All right, it's the first one of our picture ones that we've picked. Um, so, wow. I know there's at least three different Froggers. Let's switch back to this. Um, okay. So there you go. That's the uh, the end of the the maze episode. Um, I hope you were amazed. Or at least enjoyed yourself anyway. Um, obviously, we'll be back next week. Uh, Monday at 7 o'clock if you're watching on Twitch. That's 7 o'clock British time. And we'll be looking at all the different games in the Frogger franchise. Unless there's shitloads of them. And then there won't be all of them. It'll be as many as we can fit into a couple of hours. Um, but, uh, uh, sir, yes, the moderator would like me to remind you to follow um, and subscribe and uh, leave a comment if you if you're um, if you're watching on YouTube then uh, leave a comment uh, if anything you might want to add to the wheel perhaps who knows uh, and you can also email us anytime you like at retro at snugradio.co.uk that's retro at snugradio.co.uk so that's about it from me. So until next week, uh, have a good week. I'll see you then. Goodbye.